The Catcher in the Rye is a novel by J.D. Salinger, first published in 1951. The story is narrated by Holden Caulfield, a teenage boy who has been expelled from his prep school in Pennsylvania. The novel is a Bildungsroman, or coming-of-age story, as Holden struggles to find his place in the world. Holden spends a few days wandering around New York City, trying to avoid going home and facing his parents' disappointment. He has a series of encounters with people, including a prostitute named Sonny, a former classmate named Sally, and a piano player named Carl Luce. Holden is preoccupied with the idea of innocence and how it is lost as people grow older. He sees himself as a protector of innocence and imagines himself catching children who are about to fall off a cliff, a metaphor for the loss of innocence. Holden is preoccupied with the idea of innocence and how it is lost as people grow older. He sees himself as a protector of innocence and imagines himself catching children who are about to fall off a cliff, a metaphor for the loss of innocence. He is also deeply affected by the death of his younger brother, Ali, and is unable to come to terms with his grief. Throughout the novel, Holden struggles with depression and feelings of alienation from the adult world. He is disillusioned with his school and his peers, who he sees as phony and lacking in authenticity. He is also deeply affected by the death of his younger brother, Ali, and is unable to come to terms with his grief. In the end, Holden has a breakdown and is sent to a mental hospital. The novel ends with Holden reflecting on his experiences and expressing a desire to be the catcher in the rye, saving children from falling off the cliff of adulthood and losing their innocence. The Catcher in the Rye is a classic novel that has been widely studied and debated since its publication. It is seen as a commentary on the phoniness and artificiality of modern society, as well as a meditation on the struggles of adolescence and the loss of innocence.